so day date is 24 september 2024 time is this and our session day just a minute our day for our session is 1 so day One two three. Okay. And today we would be starting Express JS. Express JS. What is Express JS now? fast unopinionated minimalist web framework for node.js web framework for node.js what is that a web framework express fast unopinionated minimalist web framework for node.js so when you talk about the express.js remember that you are developing web applications the way we have developed simple http server the way we have developed simple http server in node.js project so some group of people came together and they thought that why not to develop an application out of it why not to develop a dedicated application out of it and that is nothing but what your express js is dedicated web application server you don't need to do a basic stuff all that basic stuff would be taken care by these people all the basic stuff would be taken care by these people and it is the node package it is not the official node.js library or it is not the official node.js package what is this this is the third party web development library and you will find many of many like this this is not the only but we have many libraries like express js right so we talked about the node js and we we have studied that node is nothing but what we have studied that node is nothing but what group of libraries node is nothing but what group of libraries and on the top of node they have written something called as express js but it is using all the node js internal libraries what is express.js a web framework it is a web framework you can develop applications like your simple website you can develop applications like command line applications command line web apps you can develop rest apis In short, Express.js is not the official Node thing. It is written on the top of Node.js. It is third-party library. Third-party library. So tell me, if you want to install 
this thing in your if you want to install express into your node project how do you install hello how do you install if you want to install this application if you want to install this package if you want to install this package into your node.js project how do you install think and tell me You sent the message. <coughs> Correct. NPM install express. If you see here, they already have given. Now, when you talk about the express, remember that you are talking about the web applications you can develop, APIs, the performance of the express app. The express provides a thin layer of fundamental web application features without obscuring the node.js features that you know and love it's a node.js library remember that middleware express is lightweight and flexible routing framework with the minimal core features mean to be augmented through the use of express middleware modules express middleware modules so when you say express js fast unopinated minimalist web framework for node js it is running on the top of node js okay let's click on the getting started how do we create a new express app okay now let me open the terminal cd desktop cd mon stack day one two three and now i want to create a new express project can you see npm in it so nvm use 80 we, I have switched to the npm init this is how we create the node project package name <coughs> first express app version okay enter okay so we created the node project if you see here the package.json file has been created let's create a new folder over here first express app let's move into this cd and inside this folder there is a package.json now let's install the express let's install the express paste it hit the enter now can you see express 4.21.0 this is the latest version of the express available we have so we have installed next hello world now 
Now here if you see, <coughs> first we need to have the express, we need to import the express. If you remember in a Node.js, we use the require.js and via require.js we can import the project. Now, let's try to write this thing, app.js. <clears throat> Index.js, const express is equals to require express require express const app is equals to express we need to initiate this thing on which port 300 i need to run the server on 300 now app dot get this is the get request forward slash and here we can pass a middleware request response like this so whenever if you remember in this thing also we have done same thing can you see you have created a server then accepting the get request and i want to say the same thing this is the simple get method so here also <coughs> I wanted to send same thing response dot send this is the simple get server see this is the earlier code that we have written and this is the new express code that we are writing so here you can say app dot listen on the port this port and after list successful listening we can have this function console.log and here we can say express server is running okay okay we already have created the terminal npm or node index dot yes can you see express server is learning running localhost 300 hit the end can you see this is a simple get method simple get method Any questions? No. This is clear, right? Yeah. Okay. So express, require express, app, we are initializing it, port, get so what is a get we have seen that in in our in our one of the http session we have talked about http in detail we have talked about http in detail right so http comes with the verbs like get post put delete these are the ways to request the HTTP server. So what you have done in this code? Just a minute.
what you have done in this code, what that code does. First thing, it creates HTTP server. It, it creates what internally HTTP server. So you don't need to write a lot of code the way we have written for the Node.js. It by default creates the HTTP server. It gives you request and response objects via middleware. Now, what is the middleware? You will get to know shortly. So with the request and response object, So with the request and response object, you can get the request details that client have sent and you can send, so request object, request details that client send, response object, response you can send to client response you can send to client right if you see our code If you have see our code, yeah, via middleware, so it allows client to send get request. So we have seen that there are multiple types of HTTP request. get put post delete what do you mean by get if you wanna send if you wanna get something or if you wanna get resource from server Put if you want to update existing resource on the server. Post if you want to post new resource on the server. If you want to delete resource on the server, Okay. 
so this code just allows you to get this much is the get method so consider that this code has created one http server running if there is a success if server is successfully running you will see this log express server is running express server is running successfully and it is start getting or it is start accepting the get request it is start accepting what get request so if you see here you have sent set some header then you have passed this then you need to set the status code and all these things we can do these things in here also right but express does that thing internally for you you don't need to worry about that express does that thing automatically internally so this is the basic setup we have create, created for express js any questions This is clear, right? Okay. Now, we can write highly concurrent applications in the Node.js and Express is nothing but the application over the Node.js. Express is nothing but what? Application over the Node.js. So that Express also gives you facility to build highly concurrent applications. So we have developed this thing. We have run the application also. Now, <clears throat> there is an Express generator also. There is a express generator now what is this express generator so far we have created simple node.js application and installed express in it simple node.js application and installed express in it but if you remember for the react what we had done for react we have used something called as wit wit was creating wit was creating your react app wit was creating the react app
Now, wit was one of the tool tool that that was allowing us to create the React applications or the normal web applications. So, in the same fashion, Express Generator So, in the same fashion, Express Generator is a tool for creating Express Apps. What it will give you? Folder Structure Industry Best Practices Right? Code Templates Code Templates it will give you all these things. Right. Now, if you want to create the project in via Express Generator, just stop the running server, con control C. Now, if you see npx node executable, we need to use npx is an executable express we have used this executable in a bit also generator npx express generator do you want to continue no so we need to create a new project mkdir exp app exp npx express generator right can you see a lot of things have been automatically created the way wit was giving you for react it is giving you for the express so bin public folder views app.js Pre-written code you can see a lot of pre-written code you can see here right routes and in an app.js you will see some router kind of thing can you see index router user routes some middlewares we have used and a lot of other things so intention of showing is this is that in a future we are going to use this project before but after understanding of foundations of the express that we will see that we will see later on correct So we'll meet tomorrow and we will see a few more things about the express. Okay. okay. Yeah, thank you. Yeah.